But back in the day, you thought you could, <laughs> even though you couldn't influence it, you thought you could influence it a little bit because it wasn't going for a review. But Let me go back to the point about... Uh, about the big stadiums. Tottenham's quite a big stadium. They're yeah, a big club. Beautiful stadium, new stadium. And let's be frank about it. Sporting are hardly the loftiest club in the world with the most clout, are they? It's, yeah. hardly, it's hardly Real Madrid have come to town, Bayern Munich have come to town, Barcelona have come to town. Oh, and the big guys, they've got the results and the big decision again. It's sporting. It's sporting. It, 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 at the end of the day, mm. when it's going to VR, you're now, you're now questioning the clarity and professionalism of somebody who's looking at the technology. Well, it's it, black and white. Ju just a reminder here to just that when we talk about VAR here, um, we're not talking about a guy in a booth drawing lines on a screen. We're talking about they, they have semi-automatic, uh, what mm. they call, they used to call robot linesmen. Um, then realize it's kind of stupid. So it's semi-automatic <laughs> VAR, which basically means that they use 3D imaging. It's the same system they're going to use at the World Cup. Um, I don't think the algorithm, the, the AI that puts this together, you know, has specific biases. So I don't think you can argue with, with that, you know, again, whether it was Kane or Emerson, or maybe it was Kane, uh, maybe I got the wrong end of it on TV. But um, I, I think what you can argue about, and maybe that's what Conte thought, maybe it was something to do with the ball hitting the defender, although I, I don't see how that would be the case. Um, that's the only explanation I can give. Otherwise, you know, like I said, you're arguing with, uh, literally you're arguing with a machine. Hey, Frank, I'll tell you what, away from VAR, if I'm Spurs, how about you try and come out and play, I don't know, some football, try and I, score I some be, goals I in huh? the first half as opposed to blaming VAR? I'm not sure I understand because Craig talked, you know, but, but it's true It's true that you can complain about the VAR and the decision. Yeah, Craig, please sh be quiet sometimes, you know, that would be nice, you know, I always talk. You know. Well, listen. But, um, uh, yeah. <laughs> no, but the, the thing is true that always, you can always complain about a, a VAR decision or whatever it can be, uh, because maybe uh, when you are such a poor half and first half, you know, you have to find excuses for the behavior that you had on the field and maybe try to complain about something who can give you, you know, maybe an explanation of your poor performance. But it's true that Tottenham didn't do what they had to do in the first half to make sure that would, uh, they, would, uh, they would win that game. And again, I talked about Flavio uh, Nazinho in the second half. We had two clear chances, and uh, I think Sporting had another chance where, where uh, Lugo Loris made a save. It could have been dramatic tonight for, for Spurs. Of course, there are chances with Dyer, for example, and, uh, and uh, another one, I think, and I forgot the, the player who was involved, but Benton it wasn't Curl. enough. They, all start, they only started to play, yeah, exactly. They only started to play for, I would say, the last 20 minutes, where you, it's always the same thing. It's like Chelsea, I've seen that with Chelsea, where when you reach a certain point of emergency, now you start to play vertical, now you, you, you rush a little bit your, your, your passes, your, you try to give a reason. Why you don't do that before? Why you always calculate for 80 minutes and when you feel the emergency, you start playing why, um, the way you should have played for 90 minutes? That's crazy. But it wasn't the most. Why did we lead with this anyway? <laughs> I know why. Because it's dramatic and exciting, <laughs> isn't it? I know it? why. There's a Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.